Good morning, everybody. Today is Sunday, November 24th, and Lisa and I are here in our Airbnb in Amsterdam. So we had an overnight flight from Atlanta yesterday, and we landed at about midday or so here in Amsterdam. And then Chris, when we got to go to Airbnb, just wanted to take a nap. <laughs> he said half an hour, and then it was an hour, and then it was an hour and a half. Yeah, it was exhausted, <laughs> that's for sure. Then we just got some lunch, donor kebabs, walked around a little shopping, went to bed early because we were tired. Yeah, but the uh, city I thought was very pretty. At night, the lights were really, really nice. Like uh, the canals? Yeah, the canals are really, uh, really nice. And seeing the, the boats going through also. Today we're going to go to the Anne Frank house, and I think we're going to try to go to the Van Gogh Museum as well. All right, well, it's time for us to go get some breakfast. We're going to go to a pancake house, which I think is a specialty here in Amsterdam, but on our way out, check out these stairs to our Airbnb. Oh my god, guys, I am so full right now. We just finished up breakfast at the Pancake House. I got a, what's called the Dutch Pancake. It was sweet with some ice cream and chocolate syrup. And I got the French Pancake, which had like sun-dried tomatoes on it. Yeah, I actually liked Lisa's a little bit better than mine. I had thought- It was I the was, goat cheese. <laughs> it was. Hers was savory and delicious. Mine was a little too sweet, but it was, it was still very good. We're gonna go walk off these calories that we just took in by going to the Anne Frank House, which is just a little ways down, and then we'll see you guys over there. All right, Lisa and I have made it here to the Anne Frank house, which is right here behind us. We bought tickets early because we heard they're really hard to get, so we're set. Yeah, there's a bit of a line behind us actually, but we're not allowed to record inside, so I won't be able to show any videos while we're there, but we'll catch back up with you after we explore the museum and we'll tell you what we thought of it. All right, everyone. Lisa and I have finished up touring at the Anne Frank House. I thought it was a really nice museum. It was really well laid out. The exhibit was uh, very informative, I thought. And it had a nice audio tour. Oh yeah, it's, a, it's like very automated too. You just like point at it and it gives you a description of what you're looking at. So that was really, really nice. Uh, it's definitely something I would recommend. But plan Do, ahead. <clears throat> yeah, definitely make sure you plan ahead because they only accept online tickets. We're going to go get a little more exercise in now. We're going to head off to the Van Gogh Museum because that's one of Lisa's favorite artists. Okay, we're going. <laughs> All right, we'll see you there. So we were supposed to buy these tickets early too, and we didn't, which is why we are now not going to the Van Gogh Museum. We are just sitting near the Van Gogh Museum deciding what we're going to do instead. It's, it's right there taunting us. <laughs> yep, so we're in the museum area. There's actually quite a few different museums in the area, and it looks like all of them are sort of the same where you have to buy the tickets in advance. So we're really just hanging out right now. We really don't have much else to do until our next activity, which is at 6.30 when we go to the Heineken Museum or brewery. I don't even know what it is. 
but we're gonna do a tour there so we're just gonna go wander around yeah sad we'll see you later All right, rather than just wandering around after not going to the museums, we decided to come here to the pantry in order to eat dinner. It's a traditional Dutch restaurant. I had Dutch peas. And I had what's called hutspot with like a sausage and potatoes thing. Uh, both dishes were delicious. We enjoyed them very much. It was warm and filling. We're gonna go head to the Heineken Museum. I might get a beer tasting there, but I honestly don't know. Heineken's not really my favorite beer, but it, it's made here in Amsterdam and it sounded interesting to do. So we're gonna walk that way. We'll see you guys there. Lisa and I have just finished up the Heineken experience, which you can just make out behind me. The tour was a lot more interesting than I expected it for a macro brewery. They had a lot of really cool activities and a lot of really fun things to do. My favorite was doing, they had this thing called the draft challenge, where you get to try to pour your own beer and they judge you based off of how good you pour. And I did pretty, pretty bad. Didn't win. <laughs> Lisa's was much better than mine was. <laughs> and I didn't win. <laughs> it's kind of embarrassing because I have a kegerator at home and I pour beer when I make it and uh, I did pretty pretty poorly but overall <laughs> <laughs> oh my god I didn't even calculate that <laughs> so uh, I might be a little bit tipsy right now because I got a couple of extra beers because Lisa was just giving me all of her beers you get two free beers for the tour and she gave me hers so I'm starting to feel those a little bit already but I had a lot of fun did you enjoy the, the tour? I have a video of Christopher fake riding a bicycle, so it's a win for oh, me. Oh, that's true. They had this really cool karaoke thing. <laughs> I'm sure you saw it already. I, I put it in this vlog somewhere, I'm sure. 
We're just gonna walk back to our Airbnb now, which is about 45 minutes away. So I'm sure I'll get some pictures and videos on the way there. That's gonna wrap it up for tonight. Tomorrow, we're probably just gonna do a day trip to uh, like Zanschanz or Sons. do some windmill tours. We'll see you then. All right, so I totally lied. I'm a little bit hungry, so we're gonna grab something to eat real quick. We're gonna go here to Akbar Indian Restaurant because I've been craving some Indian food, so time to eat. That was delicious. I had soup. I had some butter chicken. We're done for real now. Thanks for watching this time and we'll catch you guys in the next one. See you then.